What up, it's your boy, the Truth 31. Hit like, subscribe for all that DCU goodness on your face, neck, and chest. And man, this fucking blows camel ass. So apparently, the HBO Max series, quote unquote, with Brandon Ralph Superman is not going to happen. Oh, uh, this fucking sucks. This sucks. Because obviously, I am a big fan of Brandon Ralph Superman. I think he was an awesome Superman. I think... He didn't get the just do with his performance in Superman Returns. Obviously, that, that film, Superman Returns, not the best. And I don't think he was handled properly. But I always thought that he was awesome. And of course, if we saw Crisis on Infinite Earths, my God, he was like the best part of that show. Everyone, everyone loved him. Everyone loved him, supported him. So much so that they wanted a fucking HBO Max series with this fucking guy. That's how much he, he, he was awesome. That's how much he was awesome. <laughs> That's how much people loved him because he was awesome. He was, he, again, he was the best part of that show. Like th the crisis overall was fine. It was pretty good. But everyone was talking about his performance as Superman. Everyone was just like, oh, my God, like this. This is the Superman that we need right now. This is the super Superman that we love. And especially now, since Brendan Ralph is a lot older, he's actually grown into that Superman role. He actually looks the part. He he loves the character. He embodied what Superman was and is on that on that episode on that TV show. So it was absolutely incredible. I, I'm still watching it to this day because he was the because he was phenomenal. What, what he did with that role. Absolutely phenomenal. I was like, damn, where was this performance in Superman Returns? <laughs> like, like if he showed up in Superman, in Superman Returns with this fucking performance and it was handled way better, bro, like he, he would be like one of the best right now. He, he would be like still to this day one of the best. So according to uh, Ryan uh, Unicom, uh, the rumor that Ralph might show up in the flash fix in the flash flick seems to be sadly untrue. Yeah, because we were all speculate like maybe he might show up in like a speed force or a cameo or something. He most definitely had meetings about something Superman related this year. I legitimately can't figure out what it could be or why Michael Doherty, who was the writer on Superman Returns, was involved in those meetings. If it's not for a limited HBO series or film, The Rock and his producer and, and his production company want Cavill on the big screen, obviously, opposite Black Adam. Superman and Lois Lane is a huge focus point of DC and the CW. It has to be HBO Max. That's what I'm fucking thinking, too. Hashtag Superman HBO. Hey, we started that. Uh, my boy J.O. and I, we started that hashtag. <laughs> But but yeah, I'm I'm thinking like okay, so Michael Doherty, he was the writer on Superman Returns, and he was the writer for the X Men series with Brian Singer. I didn't know, I was like that. That's that's pretty cool news to me that Michael Doherty was actually you know involved or had meetings with like with HBO, I, I would presume, and with with Brandon Routh on figuring out like what to do for Superman show, because yeah, because like Ryan said, it has to be for HBO Max series. Because obviously the CW has Tyler Hoechlin, so he's not gonna be in that. He's not gonna make a cameo in that. He's it's not gonna fucking make a ca uh, a big screen adaptation because Henry Cavill is the Superman for the big screen theatrically. He's like he's our Superman, so it has to be for a HBO Max. And we all and we're all thinking like, okay, this is gonna happen, right? Because he's ha he's had meetings, so did the meetings fell uh, fall through? Is Brandon Routh not interested anymore? Are HBO Max not interested anymore? I don't know why, because he people like are screaming for him to to come back, and it will be and you know we're kind of lacking Superman content right now because it's all Batman, Batman, Batman. So why not? And we're gonna be like fucking one hundred and five years old until we see Harry Cavill back on the big screen for Superman. So why not? Like this seems like to be like the best of both worlds. We have Superman. We have Brandon Routh. He could be, you know, he had his, he could be like, he could have a better redemption now since, he, since he's going to be on HBO, uh, since he's going to be on HBO Max. So I don't know. It's, it seems like a win-win a for everyone, right? So uh, unless, I don't know. So it's going to be interesting to see like, you know, in the following months or years, if anything comes through. I hope so. I'm praying to God for hope so. And I know uh, there's, go there's going to be an HBO Max fandom where, where HBO is going to announce all the HBO Max projects. 
I don't know what, when that's going to happen, maybe next year or maybe um, the following year. I don't know. But that would be really cool if they would announce a Superman Brandon Roth project for HBO Max. So I don't know. I guess we'll see because I'm we're all hoping for HBO Max. But, you know, if it doesn't happen, then you know what? At least we had him for crisis. And at least, you know, Brandon Routh got the re got the redemption that he wanted and needed. And it was a win for him. And it was a win for us, the fans. So we'll see what happens. Anyway, smash that fucking like button. Subscribe for more DC content. Hit me up on Twitter, Instagram to continue the conversation. All things DC. All things Batman, Superman, Wonder Woman, Aquaman, all that good shit. And yeah. Let's keep hashtagging Superman HBO. Let's keep hashtagging uh, Brandon Routh for Superman. And yeah, because we want to see it. And we want to see Brandon Routh return on HBO Max with a big budget. Woof. That would be incredible. That would be amazing. So as always, truth out.